How's it going guys, it's DeepFryYT here, and today we're going to be reviewing the Flying Torture Device, also known as Spirit Airlines. Spirit Airlines is probably America's worst airline, maybe even worse than Frontier Airlines, which has the most crashes of any U.S. airline. There are so many bad things about this airline, so I'm going to start with the exterior of the plane. The outside of the plane is an ugly yellow. And the logo is copy-pasted from a Word document and the five-year-old scribbled in it. I probably put more time into this video than they did on the exterior of their planes, am I right? Let's move on to the interior. I'm done with the exterior. Uh, why am I even doing this? Let's just say it feels like you were shoved in a locker with nothing to sit on but a rock. A sharp rock, actually. Okay, I'll go into more detail. I did hours of studying on this, and I figured out that Spirit is, in fact, the most uncomfortable airline in America. It's also the most cramped airline. Do you think you can survive this? You will never think that ever again after you hear this next part. I will give my personal experience in a nutshell, okay? So, first of all, the pilots were one hour late because they were on the wrong plane. Then we take off... And then I look at the menu. They serve only like Pringles and M&Ms on a four hour flight. Okay, okay. That's not bad at all. But then I spill some of my drink on the tray table. And then I ask for a napkin and they said, no, you may not for a napkin. Come on, man. Really? Spirit Airlines is so stupid. Stupid. What I'm trying to say is Spirit Airlines is America's worst airline. Wait, no, 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 no. I made a mistake. It doesn't even deserve to be an airline. It's more like maybe a flying bus. But again, flying buses don't charge you for your luggage so high and lose your luggage for some reason. So what I'm trying to say is it's so bad. I hate Spirit Airlines! Zoo! Spirit Airlines, yay!